Good morning. Would you please stand and join us in the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. Would you please remain standing for a moment of silence? Thank you. Good morning, Scorpions. It is Tuesday, November 27th, and you are watching Shea TV. Clubs resume this week. Today, Tuesday's offerings are Uno and Classic Games in the Media Center. Yearbook students, your meeting is today from 2.45 until 4 p.m. Jewelry Club members, your meeting is tomorrow. Please remember to bring needle nose pliers if you are able to do so. And even more clubs. Tomorrow is Wednesday, and the offerings for tomorrow's clubs are Jewelry Club in the Media Center, do the math with Mr. Runyon in room 811. Photography with Mrs. Erickson in room 801. Garden Club with Mrs. Mitchell in room 106. Theater Club in room 201 with Miss Peters and Mr. Boyette. So again, your choices for Wednesday are Jewelry Club, Do the Math, Photography, Garden Club, and Drama Club. We've got this posted in the Media Center and we have flyers for you to take home if you need more information. So, Media Center. The genre of the month is historical fiction. November ends on this Friday, so if you want your chance to earn your candy bar, be sure to get in your 85% or better AR tickets to the Media Center. Events on campus. Come and see the NVAA Dance Company's best work tomorrow night at this year's fall performance, Art in Motion. The show is tomorrow night, November 28th at 7 p.m. in the Performing Arts Center. Tickets are $5 for adults and students with their student ID are free. Calling all seventh and eighth graders, looking to join a new club next year? NVAA Dance is holding auditions on November 29th from four to seven in the Performing Arts Center. Check-in starts right at 345. If you are interested in hip hop, jazz, contemporary, or ballet, join the dance company. Frost, do you need some extra help with your studies? Frost is a free tutoring program and it's free and available every day, Monday through Thursday from four to 6 p.m. Pick up a flyer from the media center or see any teacher to get more information. Shea Lanyards, we are now offering Shea Lanyards. They are in sale for $2 in the front office. Next up is Students of the Week. It is my honor to announce the Students of the Week, Connor Dial and Jack Taylor. Connor Dial was nominated by Mr. Runyon. Connor is a fantastic student. He does exactly what successful students are supposed to do. He shows up to class on time and is always prepared. He makes school look so easy. He has a great personality, sense of humor, and is an incredible role model for everyone on campus. I wish I had more students like Connor. Keep up the good work, Connor. I expect big things from you in the future. Our next student of the week is Jack Taylor, nominated by Mrs. Favela. Here's what she had to say. I am very excited to be able to nominate Jack for student of the week. Jack is a perfect example of what grit looks like in the classroom. He comes to class and tries his very best when he gets stuck, he will ask for help. There have been times where Jack tried to convince me that he can't do the work because it was too hard. With a little prompting from me, he goes back to his seat, works on the assignment, and turns in A-plus work. Jack, I am very proud of you and how far you have come with your math abilities. Keep up the amazing work. So congratulations again to Connor Dial and Jack Taylor. Great job, guys. I and E. Today is Tuesday, and that means traveling is contained to science, social studies, and electives. All right, it's time for our lunch choices, glazed chicken drumstick with wheat roll, a cheeseburger, and a sandwich pack. That's all for today, Shay. Make it a great one, and we'll see you right back here tomorrow. <laughs>